in a region surrounded by stately mountains, but also by gentle hills, covered with endless rows of vine, there is a place which some consider blessed, arranged on the hill ridges or even plains, ranchas vineyards gather from spring to autumn, the flavored tears of the clouds and the sun's hot smiles. There is quite a bustle there at the beginning of October, before the first white frost. The vineyards are being picked. These people were born in the cult of the wine and consciously carry on their fate of masters and slaves of the vine through work. It smells of autumn, of the season of ending and beginning. A sweet smell of must starts hovering above Rancho's hills. Dressed traditionally, the natives come in great numbers to pay tribute to the magnificent liquor by working. The villagers come to take part in this event from wherever they are. Making the must is an opportunity for the family to reunite and the first link in the chain of winter preparations. The joy of people and of the bunches of juicy beads are blended with the last warm days of the year. Some time ago, the grapes were trampled on by young people in order to get the juice. The grapes fall into the baskets and from here, the long way towards the good wine starts. Only those who have the knowledge, skill and gift can take them on this way. Broncha land proudly carries its necklace of vineyards even today, crowning its reign over the wine. The natives are renowned for their wine, but what gives it an original mark is the place where this wine is ennobled. The princely cellar winery, consolidated with pumice stone walls, became an ideal place for maturing wine. The supervised fermentation and controlled temperatures and the natural fruity taste and acidity give birth to a wine full of optimism which releases a positive mood. Pancho vaults, built in the time of Stephen the Great's reign, in the clay soil of the Bucks Valley, are made up of a central passageway from where 36 lateral galleries branch out, totaling about 3,000 meters. The wonderful champagne called Pancho is produced here using the classical method of champenoise. Bacchus, the festival of wine and vine, is the climax of the celebration of picking grapes every year. The three days of wine tasting competitions and parties attract a great number of wine producers, but also well-known artists that foster a feasty atmosphere, which turns Focșani into the capital of the Romanian wine growing. 